He's my really old man. He has dementia. Joey. I am Trish, and this is Joey's story for GeoBeats. He'll be 19 in November. Joey. 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 Joey came from a rescue in New Jersey, and his owner had to go to a nursing home and could no longer care for him. He was at the rescue for seven months, and he was very aggressive with everybody that went to meet him, except for us. He loved us, didn't try and bite us, and couldn't say no. Joey's been with us almost six years now. All of Joey's organs, all of his systems are really good. He's the only one who doesn't need medicine. The only thing wrong with Joey is dementia. Joey! Joey! He gets very confused. He starts pacing, he starts circling. In the morning, he's like, I know where I am. At night, you can tell that he's forgotten. He's forgotten people. Uh. He's forgotten me once or twice. (laughs) He's definitely a mama's boy. You'll see me carrying him around in the pouch because he can't see. He very much wants to be held so that he knows that you're there. So I do cooking and cleaning and errands and whatnot. I carry him around in the pouch. He's very loving, you know, come up and snuggle and kiss. Joey and Rocket are both almost blind, so they will run into each other and then stop. They're like, oh, there you are. Okay, I'm gonna hang out right here. And you can see them lean into each other and touch. They're like, okay, I got you. You're here and I'm here and this is where I wanna be. They do like to be near each other. (laughs) Senior dogs have definitely taught me to be more present. I don't leave the house in the morning without kissing each one of them goodbye. I don't take anything for granted, and senior dogs have taught me that. I would call Joey my heart dog. (laughs) If I could clone him, I would have a hundred of them. I cannot see you. (laughs) I will always do everything to make him happy.